Hi, welcome back to the YouTube channel. In this particular video, we'll see how to fix the Asus Viva Book Display problem. Asus Viva Book Display not working. Okay, so let's get started. So the fix number one is check the connection and the screen. Ensure that your laptop is turned on and the power light is on. If the power light is not on, check the power adapter, AC, power cord and battery. If the battery light is on, try pressing fine and function key, usually F7 to check if the laptop is responding. Adjust the screen brightness and alternate between the laptop display and connected external monitor using Fn plus F6 and fn plus f8 respectively the fix number two is reset the display mode press the windows key ctrl shift and b simultaneously to reset the connection between the operating system and the display fix number three check system compatibility ensure that your system is not overloaded as it can affect the display performance check the software you are running with if you require hardware specs and update the display driver if needed. The fix number 4 is update the BIOS on the ASUS laptop. To update the BIOS on the ASUS laptop, you can follow some of the steps. Step number 1, make sure that the AC adapter is connected during the BIOS updating process on your unit. Step number 2, download the BIOS file corresponding to the computer model with the above symptom from the ASUS support site. Step number three, format the USB flash drive to the PAT32, that is FAT32. Step number four, put the BIOS file under the root directory of the USB flash drive. Step number five, turn off the computer with the above symptom. Step number six, press and hold the power button for 15 seconds until the power LED indicator is off. Step number seven, plug the USB flash drive with the BIOS file to this computer. Step number eight, make sure the AC adapter is connected. Step number nine, make sure your computer is turned on, then it will start to resume the BIOS update automatically. The fix number four, contact the ASUS support team. So you can contact the ASUS support team from this website asus.com slash support so here you can raise your request the backend technical team they will get back to you and they will come up with a solution and they will give you the better solution okay so that's all about this particular video i hope you like this particular video guys so don't forget to subscribe to the youtube channel see you and all thank you bye bye